In this lesson, I want to explore the benefits and usage of Azure Advisor. And this is a service, it's free, that's just built into Azure, really designed to give you guidance about certain key aspects of Azure usage. I can access it through the portal or through the API to get the various recommendations. And this is probably easier to understand just by seeing it. So if we jump over to the portal, and we're gonna scroll down and go to, down here, Advisor. And what it's gonna do is break down these recommendations into five areas. We can see we have areas related to cost, i.e. we have a certain resource provisioned and maybe we should be shutting it down. Maybe it should be a different size. Maybe it should be a different SKU. Things about security, maybe we've got public facing IP addresses that aren't secured. Things about reliability, maybe we can do things to better ensure the continuity and availability of our services. Just following best practices around operational excellence. And then performance, what can we do to speed up our actual applications? And what I would recommend is maybe once a week, we can go and check in on these things. So I have nothing around cost right now. I can go to security. So this is actually integrating with things like Azure Security Center, which uses Azure policy with a predefined list of things it's looking for. And it's telling me things that I should do to improve the security of my environment. Likewise, reliability. Hey, we see you're using a standard disk. We recommend you use premium disk, which have a higher SLA, therefore would improve my reliability. And operational excellence. Don't have anything there. Likewise, performance. But you'll notice it's given me a link down here. See a list of all of the possible recommendations. So if we jump over to that, here we can see the things it might tell us about performance things it might tell us about reliability, things it will tell us about security. And this is again coming from Azure Security Center, so that's gonna be a lot more focused around integrating with Azure Security Center. Things about operational excellence, things about cost optimization. So we can actually go and see all the different recommendations it may actually give. And so it really is a great place to just go and check into, and I could see all my recommendations. I could even create alerts about certain things. I can have a recommendation digest, which is a report that will summarize all of the active recommendations available. There's even an advisor score, which based on all of the different recommendations and what ones I have addressed, I get a certain score to say, well, how good am I doing? following those various recommendations. So this is just something I would use to, hey, get some Azure guidance on those different aspects of the environment to try and make sure I'm being as optimal as possible in my Azure environment.